Today is day three in Iceland. We are driving along the south coast to the east of the country. The weather is still quite cloudy and it's even raining a bit this morning. Our final destination today is about a three hour drive away and our first stop along the road is a canyon. So I'm taking a break from making pictures. The weather is just not very good this morning and I'm not getting the result I'm looking for. Well, this canyon is truly a sight to behold. It's a pity that the weather isn't playing along, but maybe we'll get luckier later today. We have arrived at Skaftafell. It's part of a national park and we are walking up to the black waterfall which is about a 1.5 kilometer hike but it's uphill so it's quite tiresome First waterfall of the hike, that's not it yet. Now that's the waterfall we are looking for. So we arrived at the black waterfall and it's just amazing. Annie has played the model again and she walked down with the red poncho and I took a few pictures of that. I tried to do some long exposures as well as some shorter exposures because the poncho was moving and I'm not yet sure what the result will be. So I'm also trying to make a few other pictures of the waterfall and I'm trying to avoid the sky because the sky is really overcast today and it doesn't make for a good picture. So 
now I went down to the waterfall to have another perspective and to use some of the rocks here in the foreground. And I'm using the polarizer to get rid of the glare on the water and I'm also using the six stop ND filter in order to create a long exposure and capture the movement of the waterfall. Okay, we are leaving the Black Waterfall and we are going back to the car. We still have one hour of driving before we reach the highlight of the day. Last destination for today, it's the famous Glacier Lagoon here on the south coast of Iceland. And we are now on the beach and we are going to look for some nice ice cubes. This place truly is a landscape photographer's dream location. The landscape is changing all the time, the ice cubes are moving constantly and it's quite challenging to find a good composition and create a compelling picture. I think I found some nice icebergs here and I'm using the polarizer as well as a 6 stop ND filter in order to create a slightly longer exposure of about one second and I think that's enough to capture some movement of the waves and create an interesting picture. I thought my feet would stay dry with the boots, but I was wrong. That happens when you're venturing too far out in the sea. I'm now leaving the beach with the ice blocks and I'm moving over to the glacier lagoon where we should have a nice view on the mountain range behind it and the glacier. The 
ice lagoon is very different from the beach I've just been to with the ice cubes. Here everything is calm, everything is still and the icebergs are moving really slowly. But it's also very difficult to isolate subjects. So I'm making a picture that has some different layers in it from different icebergs and there is even a mountain in the background. So that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a like if you did and don't forget to subscribe to my channel to see the next videos. I will see you very soon. Bye bye.